Win2K19. So Active Directory Users and Computers here. And this is domain and go to operations masters and RID uh, it is now default is win2k16 and I'm going to change to the win2k19 change yes okay and PDC primary domain controller change 16 to 19 yes okay it is 19 now and infrastructure change yes okay it is uh, uh, transfer to the 19 close here run this command same same command again now these three roles PDC RID and infrastructure roles are moved to the 19 now we need to move these two roles for next step is transferring domain naming master so go to the active directory domains and trust here and operation masters uh, the uh, domain naming master is win2k16 click change it will transfer to the 19 change yes ok close run this command again now domain naming master also transfer to the win2k19 last schema master for that we need to access the management console mmc run yes file add remove snap in from that we need to select activity schema active directory schema add okay if you uh, couldn't found active directory schema you you need to run this command uh, rez svr 32 scsm schema mgmt dot dll yeah if you couldn't found this you have to run this command I have already there so that's fine here right click and connect to change active directory dom or domain controller and select this domain controller or ad lds instance and select your new domain controller okay okay and again go there right click and operations master now schema master is win2k16 click change and it will transfer to the win2k19 change yes ok close now run this command again query command for efsm role it will take few seconds ok all five fsm roles are transferred to the new domain controller this step is finished now 60 uh, step 6 remove GC from world domain controller you can remove from here or a previous domain controller no problem just go to the user and computers uh, active directory user and computers and here you can find the world domain controller in domain controllers container right click properties go to NTDS settings and uncheck global catalog apply ok ok and refresh here now this win2k16 is only DC not global catalog server same is here win2k16 uh, refresh here we need to restart or you can uncheck from here NTDS settings uncheck global catalog apply ok and restart once restart this win2k16 
and here we I'm going to check DNS settings it is forward lookup zones all the records are transferred to the new domain controller uh, the reverse lookup zone that's fine and check group policy group policy and there should be one demo group policy which I created in old domain controller yeah this is there is demo group policy and the sixth step is finished now we have to go through the seventh step so remote desktop win 2k16 connect it connect and okay yes in meantime we can check from the client machine command prompt run as administrator yes and run command set and here it is username is admin and domain is demo demo.net and logon server is win2k16 so we need to manage some network setting again yet this time our preferred DNS server should be our new domain controller which is which we uh, promoted as a domain controller and transfer transferred all the FSM role and DNS and group policy from old domain controller so 164 that's fine okay close and restart again okay, restarting fine I think it is restarted okay it will take few minutes the client machine is restarted I'm going to log in again and run command again command prompt and run as e administrator yes and set run set command okay domain is same user is same and login service server is win to get 19 yeah that's fine our new domain controller is working fine we need to now we need to decommission world active directory domain controller or demote World Active Directory Domain Controller. Okay, here go to Manage and remove roles and features. Next, this is server fine. Next, I'm going to remove Active Directory Domain Services. Remove features. Okay, demote this domain controller. I'm going to use force removal. Next, proceed with removal next uh, new password okay new password for the machine because of it will it will not be the domain controller so we need to provide new password for the login next demote yeah it is removing the uh, features and roles which is called demote okay machine is restarted now we need to log in through the system account or machine account provide password which you created uh, while demoting this active directory yes it is restarted and server manager is starting now again go to manage remove roles and features next 
this is the server fine and server role active directory domain services remove roles and features and DNS server because because of we transfer all the active directory domain services and DNS server to the new server next and group policy also we have already transferred next and remove removal started yeah it is removed and restarted pending we need to restart this machine from now on it will be not the domain controller it is only the domain member so restart and we restart this domain controller once okay new domain controller is restarted now go to the com uh, it's a command prompt run as administrator check the FSM role net dom query FSMO yeah, all the FSMO roles are transferred to the new server win 2k19 and DNS and DNS forward lookup zones and records reverse lookup zone and records are transferred to the new new domain controller and group policy group policy management and here this is demo group policy all are transferred to the new domain controller thank you guys for watching this video please subscribe my channel thank you